how are you today? Today is the final week of the Movie Marquee Challenge that I am doing with Heather the Crochet Witch. The final week of September, I mean. <laughs> Not the final week. <laughs> um, and, oh, wow. I tell you. <laughs> Um, in my last video, I was talking to you guys about whether or not to finish the cake of yarn, the big, the big Karen cake that I was using, or to just finish it and be done with it. And, uh, a lot of you said, finish the cake, finish the cake. Um, I tried, I tried you guys, I really did. But my hands were hurting so badly. My elbows were hurting. Um, it just was not a joy to make anymore because I was in so much pain. So I think it was the weight of the, of the piece that was doing it. I don't know. Maybe it was because I had to hold on to the, the piece because it was pretty, it's pretty heavy. Uh, hold on to it while I'm trying to crochet and my hands just gave out. I couldn't do it anymore. I was getting pains down to my elbows. Uh, and I was just like, you know what? I can't do it anymore. I'm done. Um, because if I kept going and I really messed myself up and I ended up in braces, then I'd be screwed for the rest of the season. Um, and it was getting to that point. So I was like, mm-mm. I can't, I can't afford to do that. So that's okay though, because I think it turned out pretty good. I am definitely making it for the back, for the back of a couch, um, like a couch runner. Um, and I will in how, whenever I'm feeling better, uh, I will be doing like two pillow set to go with it. So here we go. It's <laughs> Technicolor dream coat. Okay. Oh. So here it is. It's fairly wide. Okay. <laughs> it's long. So it will definitely fit on a couch and it's, it's fairly wide. I didn't measure it. I'll put the measurements here somewhere, but yeah, it's, it's a long one. Oh. Okay. So that's, that's half of it. That is the size that it should have been to be a blanket. But anyways, I digress. So, yeah. I like it. I never would have thought in a million years that I would like it. But I do. And for those of you that haven't seen it before, this is the Jacob's Ladder. Okay. Um, I have done a video before with it uh, making a sweater with the Jacob's Ladder, a pullover sweater. Um, I've made a few of them. Uh, and it wasn't so bad because the panel for the sweater was like that wide. <laughs> so it was way different, way different. Uh, so yeah, so that is finished. I actually finished a project, you guys. <laughs> well, it's sort of a finished project. Um, but you know, I, this, this was a lot of work. This really was. Um, but I, I really enjoyed the process until I didn't, <laughs> until I started to really hurt. So, um, yeah, so I'm, I'm calling it done and I've got the pillow forms and I will be doing the pillow forms later. 
don't know when. And then I very well might just put this on my Etsy page for sale. Just saying. So, yeah. Um, done. Done, done. And done. So I've been lathering myself with, uh, like, pain cream and, you know, stuff like that to try and get my arms back, my fingers, my hands, everything hurts, which really sucks because there's so many things that I want to do and now I hurt and I got to give myself a break. So I'm going to be working for the next, oh, excuse me. I don't know where that came from. <laughs> Not enough oxygen to the brain. Um, I'm going to be working for the next few days. So that will give me a chance to recoup. Um, and then, yeah, then I'm, I'm kind of not sure what I'm going to do. So, mm -hmm. um, go over to Heather's channel, <clears throat> excuse me, Heather's channel. Hi, Heather. Uh, go over to her channel and see what she is doing. Holy cow. Holy cow. Um, not only did she, is she doing the movie marquee blanket, which is absolutely gorgeous. Um, she just made, she's, she's a, I'm sure that everybody that comes here that goes there knows all about it, but she is a fanatic about stranger things. And she, she made an Eddie doll, like an Eddie Amigurumi. Oh, when she put that up and showed, I just about fell off my chair and she freehanded the whole thing. She made it all up as she went. I was stunned. I could not believe it. I was, I was so excited for her. It was, you got to go and look at it and go check it out. I think. Um, using the heartland for the the hair was the perfect idea it just it was awesome and she even did the little hellfire thing oh my god I was just like I was anyway that's not what this video is about but go check out her blanket um, because it is it is so cool like the concepts that she uses for every month's blanket like I don't understand why my head doesn't work that way. Um, but I'm very plain Jane, I guess. Like I, I have, I can't, I can't do, um, asymmetrical. I can't do, um, where things aren't just so, you know, I have to have a certain amount of different things that, you know, I don't know if I have a little bit of OCD or what, but, you know, I can't have like three of something. I have to have four, you know, like, or, um, my, when I'm doing my stitches, it has to be in twos, fours, fives, sixes, like not sevens, eights. You know, like it's weird it's it, it's really bizarre the way my brain works with stuff um and sometimes it really messes me up because and that's why I can't really follow patterns very well I can use it as a guide uh but yeah that's why this was perfect because it was fives and tens right five stitches up until the Jacob's ladder. Then it was 10 stitches up for the, the loop for the Jacob's ladder. So my brain was like, I can do that. Right. So, um, I think that's why I like it so much, but yeah, I have, I, yeah, my brain works in really weird ways and I'm sure a lot of you can relate. Leave a comment down below. If you, if you guys can relate to that, because it just drives me bonkers if things aren't a certain way. All this behind me drives me bonkers. 
I need to do something with this badly because it's driving me nuts. Uh, every time I look in the camera, I'm going, why have I got reds with blues and why have I got purples with beiges? And like, I'm, it just doesn't seem to be a priority for me until I look at it in the camera. Then I go, Ugh! <laughs> so, <laughs> so yeah, but, um, anyways, thanks for joining me. Thanks for like, don't forget, go to our Facebook pages. If you are joining in, uh, on this, on these challenges, please put your Facebook page, uh, put your pictures in our Facebook pages because we really want to see what you guys are doing. We want to see that people are actually doing this with us and enjoying it. Um, because it's, when you do stuff like this as a YouTuber, you kind of feel like you're alone in it, you know? So you, you want to know that other people are doing it. Like when we do tutorials and stuff like that, like, especially like with my tutorials, I don't ever see anybody with pictures of stuff they've made from my tutorials. I don't honestly know if anybody is doing any of my tutorials and it really puts a damper on doing them. Um, because you don't know if anybody's getting involved, if anybody likes them, you're not getting any feedback, uh, and it makes you not want to do anymore. But yet when you show what you've made, everybody says, oh, do a tutorial, do a tutorial. And then you never see any pictures in your Facebook group. You never hear about, you know, how, if they like the tutorial, you never hear any of that unless you're of course bag a day. Or something like that then it's you know bag of day cinnamon stitches you know Angela precious yarnery stuff like that then people are talking about it or you get other youtubers doing your tutorials I don't think I've ever had any other youtubers doing my tutorials <laughs> but anyway I digress um, something else I wanted to mention if you are not subscribed please subscribe it would mean the world to me. Um, I have not been, I haven't got gotten up to my 3000 subscribers and I would have thought that I would have been up there a long time ago. So I do know that there are some of you out there that are not subscribed. So I would love it if you would subscribe, hit the notification bell. I don't promote myself very much. Maybe that's the problem. Um, hit that notification bell so that you know whenever I get a video up. Okay, um, so that's it. I will talk to you guys later. I love you all. Okay, bye.